Craving is an important issue in, in addiction. Um, this refers to the person's kind of sudden intense desire for the substance, be it alcohol or cocaine or cigarettes, anything that usually a person is, is kind of trying to, to avoid. So if a person has suddenly a craving, it can often be described as just an overwhelming desire to have the thing right now. And what we often teach people in recovery programs is that craving is like a wave. It's going to go down after a while. It's something you can, you can wait out. You don't have to respond to it. It's a hard lesson to learn, though, for people who are, who are in recovery programs. We had a brain imaging study where we showed teenage heavy drinkers who met criteria for a, a substance use uh, disorder. We showed them pictures of, of uh, alcohol like pictures of beer, pictures of hard liquor, and other things they had drank before. And we showed them pictures of non-alcohol beverage pictures, like milk and Gatorade. And the kids who were heavy drinkers showed greatly increased brain response as they were looking at the alcohol pictures, but not as they were looking at the non-alcohol related pictures. In contrast, we also gave this same kind of set of pictures to non-drinkers when they were in the brain scanner, and they really didn't show many differences between uh, what types of beverage pictures they were looking at. So this seems to indicate that once you've started drinking enough to the point where you've had a couple problems in your life, you've at least gotten in trouble a few times for drinking, that there's something different going on in your brain when you see things that remind you of those drinking experiences. And it could indicate that um, when you see those kind of images, your brain kind of stops for a second and a lot of your attention is kind of diverted to those pictures or images or words or people. And I think that is an important um, component in what can lead it for some people to, to a relapse. But we need more research to kind of put together all those pieces.